If spooky is a spooky does, what is spooky if it is not is? Let's jump into the so-called scary game and put our wits to the test. What's up guys and gals and welcome to the Outer Middle Show. Matt Vlad is the name and the swine is the game. And in today's episode, that's right, we've got another spooky game on the lineup. Never played it, never seen it, never even researched it. I don't know what I'm getting myself into today, as usual. But as we always say, let's shut up and hit that new game button. Like this. <clears throat> that was very anticlimactic. Begin a new game? Yes! Ooh, right off the bat we got some demonic symbols happening. Press any key. How about space? Will you take space? The Fool. Oh, we got some tarot cards. Monday, 8.45 a.m. Ooh, that's early. Too early for me. What now? Hey there. About time you woke up. I'm going to take a quick shower. Ooh. Can you start breakfast? Sure. Sure thing. While you were asleep, we had a visitor this morning. There's no one out here for miles. Who was it? A young woman. She looked a bit dirty, to be honest. Oh, your car broke down? Maybe. She asked if she had permission to enter and to use our phone. I said, sure. But she didn't end up using it when she was in the kitchen. I wish you didn't let her in. She sounds like a drifter. Maybe. She left shortly afterwards. She also gave me a card, and I thought it was a business card, but it's some kind of drawing. I left it on your desk in the living room. Uh-oh. <sighs> Already a great start to our week off. Yeah. A dirty drifter. With a broke down car. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Let's check out this picture. Oh, oh, now I'm going to try to play this game without any lag. We've been having some a little bit of lag issues, and uh, all it is is uh, just some efficiency problems with my new rig. We're trying to work through them. It's no big deal. But so far, oh my God, my sensitivity. Uh, all right, that's a little better. Okay, uh, I think that did it. It seems like the efficiency of this game is not that well in general. And as you can tell, I'm a little bit darker on the screen. That's because it's a scary game, and I'm trying to get into the mood. All right? I'm trying to innovate here. Ooh, it is smooth, though. A little choppy. That's because we're running at 40 FPS. And nothing changes when we put it on low graphics. Okay. So we're just going to run with this and see what happens. So my girl is in the shower. I'm going to take a peep. Just let me get a little peep. My girlfriend Amy is in the bathroom. I don't want to disturb her. What? You always disturb your girlfriend in the shower. Always. Anyway, let's just keep moving on. Wow, this is a this is a very beautiful place. It kind of reminds me of my grandmother's house. The bed sheets, the flower bed sheets, the old furniture. Wow, this is it's kind of relaxing to be in here. How could this be a scary game? I don't understand. Okay, so let's go check out that so-called drawing. I hope that vagrant grill didn't touch anything. Why would you let a stranger in your home? Home anyway. What was that? Okay. Okay, so we can run. There's a run function. I'll watch TV after breakfast, so I'm assuming that's a TV room. Really odd place. Open the inventory to view your possession. Huh? Inventory. A strange visitor. Some strange girl visited the house today, apparently to use our phone, though she didn't seem all too interested once inside. My girlfriend Amy said she left some kind of card with her before leaving. It should be on my desk in the living room. Your studio's in the living room? What the hell? Oh, oh, we gotta fix that. That was terrible sounding. Alright, where's my desk? God, it's a... I'm gonna keep an eye... Oh my god, I'm going to keep an eye on the FPS counter, and uh, hopefully we don't get any uh, lag issues, or at least too bad of lag issues. Okay, let's see. Ooh, there's a picture of Aunt Margaret! Boy, Aunt Margaret loved to play the game Salsa. 
I don't want to explain what that game is, but I'll tell you what it uh, is in a short description. You throw your teddy on your back. <laughs> All right, that's as far as I'm going. I don't want to explain any more about that game. Margaret was a, a good old soul. She had a buckskin belly and a rubber butthole. Um, let's see. Open. <laughs> I need to use the downstairs bathroom. Okay. So there's a basement here. I'm staying home this week to get some writing done. So usually the basement stairs are next to the upstairs stairs. There's nothing I need in the basement. Okay, so is there anything I can do whatsoever? I don't see a desk. I could be blind. What is this? Is this a desk? Examine with Q. On the revolutions of the celestial spheres. Yeah, whatever. Kakiro! Sasiro! <laughs> Paradoxal. I don't mean. This game isn't scary at all, bro. I don't even know why I bought it. Oh, here it is. Here's the card. Man, that's a tarot card, bro. That's not a card. How did my wife not know what that was? Uh, yeah. She left us an old tarot card. Or tarot card, however you want to pronounce it. Can't say that I was expecting this. <laughs> Let's take it. I took it. Was I supposed to take it? Picked up tarot card. Okay. Uh. What now? You know it's real. What? 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 Huh? What's happening? I shouldn't have picked up that tarot card. Oh my god! Oh my god! What the hell? The high priestess. Okay, Tuesday, three ten a.m. So it's nighttime. I picked up the tarot card and my vision started to glitch. Ooh. Wake up. It's freezing in here. Sorry, I farted. Hmm. The power's off. I'll check the circuit breaker in the basement. Oh, man. Let's actually get Come the heat and lights back on. I think the lantern is still in the large dresser with the rest of the storage stuff. It's the most boring couple I've ever heard communicate with each other. <laughs> Good God, man. Uh, the fuse box is in the basement. I will go. Okay, where did she... Man, I wasn't even paying attention to her, man. Talk about boring. Hold on, let's see. Okay, so we are looking for... Alright, hold on. Lights out. The power is off and it has stopped the space heater. I'll have to grab the lantern from the bedroom dresser for a source of light. Okay, bedroom dresser. Shh, I can't see nothing in here. Oh my god, it's impossibly dark. Why is that clock so loud? Here's the dresser. Maybe we can open the bottoms? Nah. How many dressers we got in this room? Dresser, 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 dresser. No. There's a candle right there. I can't pick it up, though. There it is. Hehehehe. <laughs> so far, this game is so not scary. Okay, select item, move and hold. Gotcha. Use. There we go. Now, I hate the lantern look. That does creep me out a bit. Wait, where's my wife? Maybe I'm talking to myself. I don't know. Girlfriend is... Why is my girlfriend always in the bathroom? Can I just peep in there? They got a keyhole. Whatever. Alright. Let's, uh... Let's move on. Let's play some music. What does that say? Relax collection? Alright, these people know their music. This lantern sucks. Really sucks. I love this uh, statue. That is a statue of my Uncle uh, Pop Popper. Uncle Popper is what we called him. <laughs> he used to do this trick with green beans. I'm not going to elaborate. Let's just move on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down, slow down. Okay. Somebody's in here. Somebody is in here. I'm just going to move on to the basement. Wow. I do not like that. Moving on to the basement. Stumbling over my feet. The music has changed. Now we've got some atmospheric drones happening. Let's find that fuse box. Of course it's not going to be right next to the steps. 
Is that it? What the? What is that? One of those vacuum cleaners? The built-in home vacuum cleaners? It is. I'll be damned. All right. Uh, there's a candle somehow over here on the. Somebody tampered with this. Somebody tampered with this. They shut the main off. Task complete. Okay. So, hang on. Let, let's put this away now. Can I put that away? How do I put this away? It's not letting me. Oh, well. We'll just hold it. If somebody jumps out on me, I'll hit him with it. Oh. My. God. Oh, my God. That took my breath, bro. Uh. Hello? Sir, uh, ma'am, I can't tell if you've got boobs or uh, a pig head. I, I am confused here. Let's just walk up to it, I guess. What are you doing here? Who are you? Who are you? Why are you walking closer? <laughs> ah! Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Pigman, a uh, woman. Can I, can I leave, please? What's that supposed to mean? What? I don't want anything from you. Just get out of my house. Oh, she didn't say anything, though. Can I, can I move? I can't move. Yeah, I can't, I can't. No. I understand. Huh? You understand what? Huh? Okay, I'm just gonna... Oh. Ah! I'm just gonna walk over here. Go back upstairs to my wife taking a shit. Let's just keep on mo moving. Um... Huh? Um... B where's my wife? Um, hello? Pig people? Okay. Hello? Don't want to go over there. Yeah, that's. I don't either. I know what I need to do. What, you, what, what do you need to do, bro? What are you talking about? You've got a woman on the left, a beer gut tom in the middle, and some weird skinny thing over there. Uh, yeah, I know what I have to do. What are you gonna do, man? What are you gonna do? You, you picked up a tarot card, and now you're acting weird. Where's the bedroom at? There it is. Oh, God! Wednesday, the tower. 2.56 p.m. Yeah! <laughs> My head is killing me. Did I turn the power back on? Yeah. I don't remember coming back to bed. Your wife's dead. I just want to let you know that. She's probably dead. Hi. There's a strange smell coming from downstairs. Can you check it out? Oh, God. I can't find where it's coming from, but it gets worse by the basement door. It's probably the wind blowing your ass matter up into your face. There's a draft, okay? Go wash your ass. I don't want to go back in the basement. Come on, man. What time is it? Is it evening or is it morning time? Amnesia. Okay. I'm hoping none of that lagged. Uh, let's see. Oh, man, it's... It's my other aunt. Jarginia. <laughs> Jarginia was a master pie smith. She would put plum pudding in her pies, and they were proportionately preposterous. <laughs> they were they were finger-licking good. <laughs> I'm just gonna let's go in the basement, man. This is how I cope, okay? I say stupid stuff. What is this? He left the beer can over here. What is that, Dubmeister? Well, that's a pretty cool name for a beer. God, I gotta fix that. Yeah, I think it's morning time, I'm pretty sure. 
There's a weird smell coming. Every time I walk... Hold on. Does this dude have club feet? What the hell is this? Watch him. He's going down the steps with one foot forward. Man, oh man. Some games I just I don't understand. Wow, I'll tell you what. The graphics in this game are amazing. The setting is really good in here. This is a proper home. All right, so we're famous for going down the steps. Here we go. Okay, there's a bad smell coming from the basement. Let's investigate, I guess. Uh, bad smell. We've got a bottle of red flour. Uh, Macbeth Illustrated. I, I don't know. Ooh, we've got some canned food down here. We got some pickled eggs and some pickled pickles. Some pickled potatoes. I'm talking about. Got some ferment action going. Yeah, that's strange. Let's go behind the steps, maybe. Here's a tape. It says grimy VHS tape. Okay, what the hell? It's just a tape. Task complete. How could something... Uh, yeah. Did that just turn, or am I stupid? So there was a stinky VHS tape down here. Alright, let's, uh... Let's keep moving. I'm just gonna... That... That mannequin's not really... Never mind. I'm gonna skip that part. Let's just go upstairs. Let's, uh, where there's a VHS tape, there's always a VHS player. Well, I'll tell you what, I miss Movie Warehouse. That was fun. I miss going somewhere to get a movie and renting it. That that was awesome. I miss those days. So, oh, the TV room. That's right, we've got a TV room. Okay. All right. Oh, look, we got... Oh, my God, why does it keep making that sound? Hey, Death Bloom, I played that game. So are these the same people that made... Death Bloom? Hang on. Hey, can we close that? No. Chando Street, The Nightmare on Chando Street, Silent, Silent Thrill. I don't remember those, but I do remember Death Bloom. Okay, cool. Uh, let's look around a little bit. So, yeah, this is a TV room, a grown up TV room. Why didn't you just put this in the living room? You'd have more room for seats and chairs and stuff, but whatever. Let's insert this. Power on VHS player first. Okay, there you go. Tape. We'll use the tape. There we go. What do we got to do now? Turn on the TV? Gee whiz. There we go. Well, we got to hit play. I knew it. Okay, so... 11-8-2020? Huh? Okay... All right. What do we got? A peeping Tom here or something? Is this my house? I don't know if this is my house or not. This could be my house. Yes, this is my house. Now, as long as they don't come up in the TV room, I'll be fine. Let's see. Are there any windows over here? Okay. Two windows. Yeah, somebody's peeping in my house. This is them pig fuckers that came in the other night. Four seven three five. Four seven three five. Four seven three five. Got to remember that. Four seven three five. Okay, that was interesting. A stalker VHS taped my house. Wow, look at the environment out there. It looks good. Looks really good. This game's really well made. Besides the frame rate, so it needs to be a little bit more possibly optimized. But other than that, looking good. Let's see what's on the list of things to do. Absolutely nothing. Let's go find my wife. Oh my god. <sighs> Amy? Did you eat them daggone blasted chili dogs again? I told you not to eat that chili. Or them hot dogs. I left them out in the summer heat for like a week. <laughs> you just had to cook them and eat them anyway. Okay, so let's go downstairs and see if we can see. Now, the date on that was really weird. There's got to be something down here we're going to see, obviously. Can we go outside? 
Oh, wow. Yes, we can. We can go outside. Look at the sky, man. If I went outside and the sky looked like this, I'd go right back inside and probably go to sleep. Or get in a closet or something. Let's read this. This is the house we need you to watch. It appears to be just a woman and a man. They seem to be in sound body and mind without much connection to the outside world. We need to know how isolated they are out here. They are the most viable out of all the houses we've been watching. Alistair will be quite pleased if this goes right. The Wheel of Fortune. Alistair? So, um, hmm. Weird. Some kind of cult or cult leader, possibly? I don't know. Wheel of Fortune is actually a tarot card. I've had my, a tarot card reading done on me. And the centerpiece. I don't know. I, I can't remember how tarot cards are read, but the centerpiece of my reading was the will of fortune so that's how i know what that is this was a long time ago okay i'm not into tarot cards shut your mouth all right let's put that down so we're being watched why there's a letter sitting there i have no idea and this, this is pretty cool i mean the vegetation isn't like super deep but uh well planned i need to mow my grass this is embarrassing all right, so we got another lantern. I'm assuming that's the lantern I had maybe last night. Let's go in here. What is this? Four, seven, I think it was four, seven, three, five. Test my memory. Hey, hey. Uh, Amy? Amy? There's a goddamn pig head out here. Did you put that there? I think Amy's in on something. Okay, we got us a nice big axe and... Oh, okay, calm down, calm down, calm down. Right now. God, my head is killing me. I can't do this. No. I have to. You what? Those things that girl said. I can't let them happen. Okay. So do we put the pig mask on too, maybe? I'm about to go kill my wife. I've got a weird feeling that I'm about to go slam my wife in the head with this axe. I don't want to, obviously. But, oh my god. Hold on, just, just stop for a second. Stop. Think about it for a second, alright? She's your wife. She is great. She's awesome. She cooks you food. She got you your first job. Oh my god. Uh, we're gonna have to stop meeting like this, sir. Uh, I have an axe in my hand, and I whip. Okay. I don't have my pig mask on, guys. Um, another tarot card. Let's examine this. The tower. I don't know what that means, but... Wow, there's just more of you that keep appearing from around the wall. That's fantastic. Whole big family here. You got you got Papa right there. Or Peepaw. I don't know who you are, man. You got I don't they look they look rotten. That one looks rotten anyway. I don't know. You got the brother, the sister, the mom. Okay. You guys have fun over there. In the corner. I'm just gonna go upstairs and kill my wife. If that's fine with Sweetie? you. Sweetie, are you sleeping? She's not. Oh hey, my. Honey, did you find out where that smell was coming from? Friday. 2 days later, 9:15 p.m. Uh, yeah. Okay. This is really creepy, I must say. I feel so nauseous. Did I have a nightmare? This air is so heavy. I feel like I'm gonna be sick. Please tell me you didn't kill your wife, man. Why? Why would I? What did that creature say to me? Who are these people? Every time, I start to remember. It slips away. Like, 
Someone turning a light on and off. I locked the basement door. Something's not right down there. Okay. Can we, uh, can we go now? Get out of this dialogue and continue on. Thank you, sir. Okay. Trying to make sense of this. Clouded thoughts. Okay, so I'm assuming my wife is dead. The bathroom door is locked. Damn it, man! What, what time is it? It's 9 o'clock? What the hell, man? Where's my lantern? Please be in here. Damn it! Do I got it in my inventory? Nope. Where is my lantern, man? Let's just go. Let's get out of here. Let's just get out of here. Let's go downstairs. See what we can see. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, so... Oh, back door's open. The back door is open. Looks like somebody broke in and kicked over that thing and punched my, my picture. They didn't touch Aunt Margaret, though. Okay, so the porch has been blocked off. We got some candles over here. Got a key. Take the key. Picked up an old key. Fantastic. Okay, so I'm assuming that's the the basement lock key. Let's go. Oh, what's this? Oh my god. That's really loud. Okay, this is a bathroom. I hate those clocks. Okay, something is missing. Something's missing from the door. Huh? What? What's missing from the door? So what, we gotta look for something? Oh, shit. Okay, so we got a pig head in there. We got us a nice big pot. Did we cook our wife and eat her? That's what I'm wondering. Got mushrooms and pickles and eggs being fermented and shit. They're wanting me to put that pig head on. I ain't doing it. I got a key to something. I don't know what it is, but we got a key to something. Maybe the bathroom door? Yes! Yes! We unlocked it. <gasps> a lot of blood on the wall there. Or I'm assuming some ketchup or something. Uh, oh my god. I hear whispering. This can't be good. Uh, Amy? If that, if that was your name, I can't remember. Oh, another tarot card. Picked up a tarot card. Five, five of cups. Okay, I'm, I'm pretty sure she's in there dead. I don't see a body though. I do see a uh, bioluminescent blood. All right, let's just keep on moving. Okay, there's a mannequin right there that wasn't there before. Awesome. What's up with mannequins and scary games, man? Okay, I hear crying. Ooh, I hate this. I'm not liking this now. Check the basement door. Okay, door's missing something. Just keep going. Is there someone standing out there? I think, I, yep, there's somebody, yep. Two people standing there. I knew it. Oh, there's a third. Here they are. Guys, what do you want from me? That's that's all I want to know. What do you want from me? What am I supposed to do? Oh, there's the pot belly pig one over there. Okay, guys, uh, you guys can go home now and leave me alone. Okay. So now, I'm just confused on what to do. We're just gonna we're just gonna run around. What is this? Take tape. Picked up household tape. All right, cool. Let's see, maybe play some music or something. I don't know. Oh, oh we got a note. All right, let's read it. Alistair is getting sicker by the month. He'll need a new body sooner than expected. Come on now. I know what this is. I don't know why we can't just do this now. The Charlotte. He said the vessels must be willing. Be more patient and wait for the correct moment. The Hanged Man. So these are tarot cards. They're identifying as tarot cards. I guess everybody else is identifying as other things these days. So why not? All right. Let's get out of this. Put that down. So they're trying to take over, I'm assuming, uh, a body. 
either possess it or live on or live uh you know live on through someone else's bodies kind of like using them as a parasite seen these things many times before all right we're back upstairs i'm trying to figure out good lord what's going on man I can't seem to figure it out. It's so weird that once you get even remotely close to the clock, it just starts ticking like crazy. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. I just took the tape that was in my inventory and combined it with the tarot card, and it gave me this. So, maybe I take this. I tape it to the door. <laughs> I knew it, man. I knew it. Then we can open it. Yeah. That made a whole lot of sense. Okay, so there's the axe that I used to kill. Wow. This got really atmospheric all of a sudden. Let's go this way. Maybe we can take a peep back there. See a lot of candles. Uh, Yeah, but I can't really see through it. So, oh, I hate this. And there's a body. <sighs> there's a body right there. And we're glitching again. So they're controlling my mind. Let's see if anybody's standing around me. Nope. We killed her. Saturday. 7.31 p.m. All right. <laughs> yes. So, that's the first time I've ever used a tarot card to open a door. And not in the way you think. I understand now. I was a fool. I was a fool. Okay. Cool. You killed your wife, so that's pretty stupid. Yeah, so that made you remember. Let's go back. Transformation. Let's pick up the axe, maybe, and hit some pigmen with it. These are the these are the pigmen from. Uh, does Minecraft have pigmen? I don't know. These are the Angry Birds pigs. Wow, this looks radically different. Somebody's going to have to fix that grandfather clock. Okay. We've got an easel or something up here. <laughs> Nobody's home! Leave me alone. Nobody's home! I did what you wanted. Yeah, now I have no one to cook me dinner. Thanks, asshole. I was the worker, she was the cook. And we worked symbiotically together as a household and a family. And she was a damn good cook. She did it way better than I could have ever. You made me kill her. I know they're out there. Okay, so what do we do from here? You can't bring your wife back from the dead. Maybe let's play some music. Let's see, no, that don't work. I don't remember their... Sir, you can't come in my home, that's... that's that's house invasion, okay? And I will be forced to shoot you in your mouth. That's really creepy, dog. Let's, uh, let's see. What's this? Let's read this, maybe. Don't sneak up on me, please. The vessel is ready for Alistair. Make sure the others have made appropriate arrangement at the church. The moon. I knew it. In the last episode, the moon deleted his dialogue, which made me delete that part. And now... The moon made me kill my wife. I hate that damn moon. It's always up to no good. Alright, so... Where are we going? Can't really go in the basement. Let's walk up to him. Hello, sir! Is this my vessel? No. He looks plenty ready. Prepare the ceremony. Hey. 
I don't like the way you ran at me. I don't like that. All Transfer right. Transfer my spirit upon this vessel. You're gonna become my wife? You better be prepared to get banged a lot. Let the left hand embrace and nestle. Okay. Oh, we got another pig person over there. Oh! There's the skinny Have dude. Your spirit break and pine. <sighs> Let this body bend and become mine. Okay, dude, this is getting a little bit too creepy for me. Can you please shut up? Oh god. What's happening? What's happening? Why is she why is she standing there with her neck all sideways? She must have taco neck. Marlon Dunn as the protagonist, Jesse Caruso as Amy, Patrick Madonna as Alistair? Huh? Okay. So for some strange reason, at the very end, the game started lagging really bad, and it was lagging out my recording. I was going like this. The sound was coming in good, but whatever. All it said was a game by Vincent Laid, or however you say his last name. Laid, lad, I don't know. But that was very interesting. This was a really short game. If this game had, like, maybe an extra 30 minutes to it, you know, it would have been so much better. It had me asking a lot of questions at the beginning, but it didn't really put it all together at the end. I mean, I understand that they were trying to get his wife's body... They needed a puppet to kill a host or something like, I don't know. Were they trying to possess me or possess my wife? I don't know. It was really, really satanic and uh, really, just, just really weird. Graphics were good. I, I did get quite a few jump scares. Well, a couple, but whatever. All right. So uh, <laughs> that about wraps it up. Guys, if you want to support the channel, check me out on Patreon. I'm doing a band gameplay series uh for the ten dollar tiers and up it's the best thing i've ever done go check it out if you're interested also follow me on instagram we're trying to get to fifteen thousand followers i post a lot of stuff about you know my personal life and uh updates i do a lot on instagram so follow me there check out the merch we've added a lot of new merch man it is the best in the industry and check me out on twitch every saturday around 12 o'clock est i love you guys thank you for the support and i'll see you in the next one